Yummy. That's way worse than the other one. It is way worse than the other one. We're Rachel and Cole. We're a little more than a month into renovating our 2007 travel trailer. We thought we took care of all of the water damage last week, but turns out there are a lot of unexpected problems in this process. I don't know what else that could be besides water. Subscribe to follow along. This is Working for the Wild. I have a really good feeling about this next chapter moving forward in the camper. If you watch our last video, you'll see that we had some issues with water damage and fixing the leaks and um, resealing the outside. I'm not really exactly sure how far we'll get this week. I am going to start by taking measurements for these holes in the wall. Um, also got to put in some new insulation and then I'm going to start patching up just some of the little imperfections in the walls, the little screw holes. So it's just going to be a little bit of this, a little bit of that, but it's going to be a good day. There's a world inside my head. I get lost in me from time to time. After like five different recuts, more cuts, we finally got the panel into the wall. Um, it doesn't look terrible. I am going to try to use some liquid nails to just get it to stick to the wall and then I'm gonna go through with a nail gun. some of this stuff, this liquid nails at first, and then I used this nail gun, which I would not recommend. This thing is awful. We don't have an air compressor, so that one just like plugs into a normal outlet and it's super weak. Like <laughs> I had to go through and hammer everything in afterwards. And then I cut just some small pieces to go over there. This whole wall is gonna be covered in wood paneling, so you're not even gonna see that. So it doesn't really matter that it doesn't look great. Sorry, it's really loud on this street right now. I'm gonna call it a day and then, believe it or not, it's supposed to snow again tonight, so we gotta hunker down once more. Getting really tired of this, Colorado. So a lot has changed in the camper since the last time we turned the camera on. We really haven't shown anything in the last few days. Probably the biggest thing is that the countertop is out. Cole just did it by himself and it was easy, right? Literally just unscrewed it. Four screws. Oh, we now no longer have a hole in the wall in the bathroom either. Looks much better. And again, this is in the closet, so you're not gonna see anything in here, which is why we didn't care if like this looked perfect because there are gonna be cabinet doors on here. Also, it's really warm in the camper today. This is like the first hot day that we've had. Uh, so far this season in Colorado, which is hilarious because like a week ago it was snowing. Now it's like 80 degrees. What do you think back there? Just exploring. Next steps include totally getting rid of the holes in the walls, the little holes, sanding all of that. We also need to replace the sides of the cabinets here. We took these off. Um, I don't really like the look of them. Just take it one step at a time. So we thought our issues with water damage were over. I was going around filling the crack along this wall and found this that appears to be water. It's not wet and it's not wet behind here, but um, I don't know what else that could be besides water. And when I pulled the trim piece off, water fell out of the bottom. <laughs> so, yeah, these are all worthless. They're all broken. 
There's a really bad spot, it looks like, right in here somewhere. I mean, if all of these are rotted, wouldn't the leak be like where these were? Well, I'll pull this Ew, off. Ew, we'll these are like growing things. I'm gonna keep doing my thing and hope everything works out with that whole situation. Oh good. Yummy. That's way worse than the other one. It is way worse than the other one. A piece of wood literally just fell out with that. I gotta be done for the day. I have to go do real life work. So Cole's on his own doing yet another corner seal repair. It's pretty gross. Yeah. It's pretty gross. To be continued. All of this restapled all the way up. We got it cleaned up. I put some rust proof paint on there. We're going to let that dry for a while while I clean off the kind of trim piece that goes down the side. So I'm gonna fix a little sealant up on the roof to get that ready. And then I'm going to clean that off, let this paint dry, and then hopefully start putting it back together. Mm -hmm. 